Hello everyone, it is me, and today I'm going to be talking about the Leeds riots because it's been all over the news in the British tabloids and on the internet because essentially they have been a riot over a gypsy family getting their five kids away. I don't, I'm not sure this counts a baby because I'll just say it now. Essentially, the reason why why social services took the baby away was because of because apparently all the children and had bruises and the baby was being had was like either fallen was thrown out of the first floor or fallen out of the first floor. So they were taken away and they were the right because of that. Now I'm gonna give my my say on the issue because I think I think it just goes to show that some people are just want to watch the world burn, as it as it says in Batman the Dark Knight. Because at the end of the day though now we don't know all about this case, but the mother maybe maybe is maybe innocent. However, I think otherwise. Because if your kid, your baby, is getting thrown out of the first floor, and your kids have bruises, they're very likely abuse in that household. Very likely abuse. Because if it's a baby, how's it jumping out the window? Are kids throwing it out? Are the children throwing it out of the window? I don't think so, to be fair. So, I think social services were certainly right in this case to take the kids away because that was just common sense. Like that, just that doesn't that that would be a big coincidence if it is. And another factor as well is that maybe it wasn't. Maybe in a small chance, in my eyes, it wasn't abuse, and it was generally just a coincidence. Maybe the children was fighting each other, and one of the kids fell <laughs> out the window, which I doubt, and they decided to say, right, this is this is actually a good family. And, and and the mother is not to blame for it, it's just children being children. Possibly so, but but why would you go around burning buses and having a riot and setting fires? What would that do to your cause? Because whether you want to make your cause seem good, you don't go around trashing, vandalising and doing criminal damage or any criminality whatsoever because if you're doing stuff like that, that just going to make your movement look bad. It will just make your movement look bad. So what have they done? If this is a genuine case and it's just not thugs being thugs, they just set the movement back to try and defend this woman. Years, because people are just going to associate associate this issue with 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 a bus being set on fire, is them scaring away police, which I do think the police should have done more. Like the thing is with UK police and that some. Certain poli- there are certain types of police, and police don't have guns such as in the US, which I think is a valid reason why we should have some now, because they were generally getting chased and out, out of Leeds, essentially, out, at least in that area. So I think that's the reason why we should have guns, because they shouldn't be running away, there were tons of them, at least, at the very least, 15 of them, police officers, or even more, and there's literally clips out there of them running away like cowards, which... Which shows that I think the normal ordinary police should be more repaired, i.e. with guns and stuff like they do in the US. Yes, I could understand that could have some disadvantages, such as more such as police abusing their power. But I digress. I think that does show that we need more protection to be safe in issues in situations like this. So, yes, yeah, so it just shows that I think most of were just basic fuggering. People want to just ruin their, ruin and just call, ruin their, their area. And just cause issues for the sake of causing issues. Cause, like I said before though, this doesn't help anyone. Cause, like I said before though, same thing, thing like with like Ted Ted Kaczynski is a common example. Of that while I don't really personally like him that much, I don't think he's said anything valid. Lots of people do like him because of his anti technology approach. I'm just using this as an example, but he did literally kill tons of people, and now he's essentially associated with that. So people, even if he may be right, which I don't think he is personally. He is, essentially, he is essentially associated with that. So his movement, his Luddite movement, isn't going anywhere that much at this moment in time, at least. So, yeah, that's another example. What would be another example? An old example would be probably Guy Fox. He was a Catholic. He didn't agree with, with Protestants from the country, so he decided to try and blow up Parliament. Now people, see, now, people just correlate with him with people who are anti-Parliament, which, despite what you thought about, 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 about whether you were on the monarchy side or the Parliament side in those days, it was like, I believe around 1500 at, at the very earliest. I mean, I think 1600 is the most... I think 1600s were when when Guy, Guy, Guy Fox tried to do the gunpowder, gunpowder plot to Parliament. 
but he didn't succeed. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter since he's only so strange. We're trying to, at the very least, blow up, a, blow up a building. And I'm quite certain, I'm very certain that there were people inside the building at that time. So because he was going to essentially kill tons of people. So the people were called, so for people who are anti parliament, they associated with people like Guy Fawkes, unfortunately. So yeah, all they wanted to say at the end of the day, I think most of it was just like people just wanted to cause, cause, cause just chaos for the sake of causing chaos. And those people should be punished. Like, vandalism doesn't do anything to your movement. It just makes you like thugs and animals at the end of the day. Like they didn't be, didn't help themselves at all if they generally did care, which I don't think they did. I think they just wanted to cause chaos and anarchy. That's really what I think it was mainly about. And we should be locked up for that. So anyway, p- punk on what you thought about this. Did, did you agree with the Leeds rights or didn't you? I thought I was opinion. So anyway, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Goodbye.